Incredible work, Miles. Stick close to Feast. If the convicts get desperate, they may try to raid the shelter. Way ahead of you. Anything else happens here, I'll let you know. Great. Thanks, Miles. Yuri, figured out Rhino's deal. He's attacking Oscorp's relief centers. Think I know which one he's hitting next. Reports of a possible earthquake and or demolition derby at the Harlem Center. Sounds like our boy. Headed there now. You holding up okay? Tired, but hanging in there. We'll get through this. Keep the faith. Reports are coming in that Martin Lee, along with exhibiting freakish abilities like those of you-know-who, has lately seemed to display almost a split personality. <laughs> this is hogwash and a clear attempt to evade justice for his crimes. Only a fool would believe that he's Mr. Positive one moment, helping the poor with a smile, then suddenly he's Mr. Negative, blowing up way a minute, Mr. Negative. That's gold, Jared! Gold! Trademark it! Stat! <laughs> as I was saying, folks, Morton Lee's evil side, or as everyone is now calling him, Mr. Negative, has been revealed as the culprit for the City Hall bombing. Someone your own size, Rhino. There is no one my size, Hulk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Rhino, we put the team up. Thought you were a loner. Means an egg, Hulk. All of life is means an egg. So what's the end for these particular means? Freedom! True freedom! Yeah. No more cute! No more Rhino! Okay, Rhino. Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oh, Scorps, love you, but you do know it's rude yeah. to cut in, right? What were you gonna do if I didn't show up? Beg him to give up? Oh, yes, Duncan. That is exactly what I would have done. Ah, oh, like an old married couple, you two. <laughs> Guys, and I 
Octavius, huh? You have a name yet? The Scary Six? The Dirty Half Dozen? How about the We Murdered Spider-Man and you take corpse for a blanket? Hey. Sergeant, please! You embarrass yourself! Can't believe I'm stuck with a moron like you! Come here and I'll fix that! Get him, you idiot! Get him! Come down and help me! Guys, please! There's plenty of me to go around! Getting his super move. What did Octavius promise you, Scorpion? Money. Sargon has no principle. He fights for profit. Untrue. I'd rip Spider Man face off for free. The money. Buddy. And leave your soul uncrushed? There is fun in that! Come here, Pouch! I will teach you to throw real punch! My jaw's already absorbed that particular lesson, thanks! I hear you took a poetry ah! class for rap, like a therapy ah! thing? Nah, here is late. Along came Simon. I sat down beside him, then crushed his tiny body to bed. That's so good! Ah! Ah! So much. Octavius will do if he finds out you failed! I failed? Yes, you, freak show! A little force together time might help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. 
I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. Pete, hey. I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sables, man. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. Witness called in an active drug deal. Please mobilize on Museum Mile. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. I need to get into the security room to unlock it. Excuse me, the lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to uh, temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security sweep. He'll never survive this. Next election, he'll get destroyed. There's the security room, but that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Off limits, ma'am. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. A health emergency might do it. Really? Come on. Let's go talk to security. Hey, let us back upstairs. I've got a medical emergency here. Oh, every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. That should do it. Crap. Jerry, get out here. We got a situation. Get out here right Security now. room's open. Just, as important Just need as to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said. Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Okay, okay, I'm gone. Control, grid clear. Repeat, grid clear. <sighs> Multi-million dollar building with network speeds from 1995. <sighs> Ridiculous. I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. The hell was that? Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out. 
And the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Continuing sweep. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire him. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? What is this thing? Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. If Norman bids his son farewell. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. I know he left last summer, but was it July or August? Harry kept a journal. Maybe he recorded the date there. Norman locked up Harry's room, wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? Dad, on my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip, 
Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but... Thank you, Dad. You know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. certainly likes to remind guests of his status. A photo was removed, though. Wonder what was there. God, Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location.
Bingo. Super creepy. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. Norman Osborne. GR-27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's Breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure? I almost can't believe it. Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. <sighs> Kinda makes sense, though. Michael's is the lead on Devil's Breath. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. Had no idea they owned so much of New York. Sable troop deployments. <sighs> They're stationed all over the city. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Bet I'm looking for a heavily guarded Oscorp building that Dr. Michaels visits. Nope, that's just a sable patrol. Dr. Michaels went to this Oscorp building, but there's no security detail. This can't be it. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or sable. That's not it. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michael's path. Don't think I've chosen the right categories. Nope, that's just a Sable patrol. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable. That's not it. Where do these three categories overlap? That must be the lab's location. What are these things? Prototype hand grenades? Norman's got a real mad scientist thing going on. child's x-ray, but it's not Harry or Emily. Who is this? That aura around him. Is this Martin Lee? Harry and Emily's medical records. GR-27 was developed to treat them. Devil's Breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. Looks like a map of the Upper West Side. Nope, that's just a Sable Patrol. Dr. Strom, isn't he a robotics expert? Commercial buildings. Bravo, bravo, bravo. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michael's path. Wow, so many records for Oscorp building. But no Michaels or Sable. No movement from Doc. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. 
Wherever the anti-serum is, he must have been too. Hmm, looks wrong. GR-27! That's the code name for Devil's Breath! This is it! Tenth and Cathedral? Isn't that... I knew it! Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR-27, Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? Who's there? Oh, no. Have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. You're amazing. <laughs> it's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You... you find Norman. You find the cure. 
Thanks, partner. to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. Hey, Norman's on his way to get the anti-serum. Better update Yuri. I hope this is good news. It is. Oscorp just created an anti-serum. There's a cure? Oh, thank God. How quickly can we get it to people? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and Cathedral. Wait. I just got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh no. That could be Norman's helicopter. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry. I'm on it. This'll all be over soon. I promise. What's the status of our Kips Bay position? Observation post is live. Scanning for Spider-Man. Care of these demons before I can follow Lee into the lab. Time to KO those snipers. demons quick before Lee gets a hold of the anti-serum. off stealthily. You literally didn't see that coming. Easier to take these guys out if they're split up. Chewed through Sable. Lee's on the warpath. Oh, 
Try to do this quietly. Spider-Man, leave now. My men will handle it. Sable? We wiped out the agent stationed here. They're not handling anything. You have been warned, superhero. Sable made good on her threat, but these guys aren't looking to team up. Tired of you harassing our agents, Spider-Man. Dead tonight. You guys think I took out your men? You gotta be kidding me! Get inside. I wish Sable would cut me some slack. We should be on the same team. Demons and Sable are down. Time to follow Lee inside. Why are you so heavy? You harass my men, destroy my equipment, and cost my client millions. Give me one good reason I should not kill you right now. Listen, I don't like you, you don't like me. But Lee has your client inside this building right now, and he's gonna kill him if we don't do something. We could fight each other, or we could fight Lee, but not both. Does this mean we're good? You will help me secure Norman. After that, I make no promises. Works for me. Lee's out of control. Oh. You secure Osborne. I will talk to them. Perfect. Oh. Okay, Lee. No more running. This ends tonight. find a way to reach the Martin Lee I know. The man who built Feast. No way to go but down.
I know what happened to your parents. The accident? You sound as clinical as Osborne. My parents died because of me. Because of what Osborne did to me. You're more than your past. Don't let it control you. I tried so hard to make my parents proud. To honor their legacy. But to truly honor them, Osborne must see justice. I won't let you do this, Martin. Lee's pain, his anger, it's fueling his power. Sample. No, no, Martin. I told you I'm sorry. It was an accident. I was trying to help. You don't help people. You use them. Won't bring your parents back. Why do you insist on trying to save this piece of scum? I'm trying to save you, Martin. Don't let revenge win. Fight it!
it, Martin! You can walk away! No! Osborne must suffer! This is the wrong way, Martin. Ugh! <sighs> 
Otto? That look on your face. You can't imagine how satisfying it is. Ready for your final act? not worry about him right now. He needs a hospital. No. No hospital. Feast. I need to speak to your head doctor. There's no doctors here. Well, who's running this place? Me, mostly. Oh, okay. Well, it's been a while, but I'll do my best. I'll need masks, uh, gloves, All whatever right. you have that's sterile. Thank you. You can thank me by not dying. Oh my god. They say she could go at any moment. Where are you going? I need to find Otto. He has the anti serum. <laughs> Maybe you can't. Maybe Spider-Man needs help from his friend Peter. What? Peter helped build those arms, remember? If anyone can find a weakness, it's him. Go get him, Tiger. That's not it. Maybe it's this one. No. Uh, uh. MJ's right. Built the neural interface. That means I can destroy it. There must be something at the lab I can use.
All units advised, we are receiving reports of a lot Spider-Man. Hello. Man, I gotta change this number. I must miss New York. Recent events... Give me pause. Your rescue of Osborne, despite his hatred, it affected me. I must return home. Reflect on this life I choose. Dang! I think I'm actually gonna miss you and your death troopers. Unfortunately, my agents will stay. Though I question our work, they do not. And Osborne continues to pay. I am sorry. So close to being good news. Indeed. I will miss you and your bizarre witticism, Spider-Man. Until we meet again. What a strange, violent lady. Did the impossible, Doc. But now I have to destroy it. With a little creation of my own. to beg? Not gonna happen! <laughs> the world will know the truth before they mop you off the pavement. Oh! Oh! Tell them what you did! I... never... Oh! Everything you have is built on lies! Lies! Ah! You stole my company, my ideas! Now, the truth. The truth. Okay. The truth is, you were only ever worth a damn when you worked for me! The truth is, you could never accept that I'm better than you! You're a failure, Otto! And you always will be! Otto, you've worked your whole life to help people. Please. You're fighting the wrong man. But have it your way. You don't have much time! Please! I'll turn over the anti-serum when Osborne pays for his crime! <laughs> Just give me the answer! You 
You've already done enough to ruin Osborne! No! No! He always bounces back! He has ruined everything!
such a disappointment. Parker. You knew? I tried to warn you, Peter. But you didn't listen! You knew! I won't let you win! This means too much to me! Not more than it means to me! If you want to change the world, you have to be the kind of man who can make the hardest decisions. <gasps> I couldn't agree more! I saw you as a son. I should have known you'd turn on me, just like all the others. Turn? Turn? I've worshipped you, your mind, your conscience, wanting to help others, the way you never gave up. That's because men like us have a duty, a responsibility to use our talents in the service of others. 
Even if they don't appreciate it. We have to do what's best for those beneath us. Whether they understand it or not. No, you're wrong! You are everything I wanted to be! You just threw it away! Yes, of course. You're right, Peter. Oh, I see that now. The neural interface affected my mind. But I can fix it. We can fix it together. If you'll help me. Do everything I can. I'll make sure you get the best help. No! If they put me away, they'll take my arms. I'll be trapped in this useless body. Please, Peter. That wasn't me. You said you'd never abandon me. You promised. Remember? And of course, you rest easy, knowing your secret is safe with me. You do what you think is best, Doc. It's all any of us can. Peter? Even when it hurts like hell. Peter, where are you going? It's still viable. We'll need the entire sample as a base to produce more doses. How long will that take? A few hours. Maybe a day. What if we use it to cure someone right now? Then there won't be enough to cure the others. I'll give you a few minutes. You're gonna be okay, ma'am. I've got the cure right here. Take off your mask. I wanna see my nephew. You knew? I've known for a while. I never wanted you to worry. I did. And I am so proud of you. And Ben would be too. All the people you've saved. I don't know what to do. Yes, you do.
So? Hi, Mary Jane Watson, associate editor. Congrats. Thank you. I knew you could do it. <laughs> what about you? Find a job yet? Oh, no, but, uh... I'll be right with you, honey. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I was actually considering maybe a career change. Hmm? Yeah, I think I might want to become a chef. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, it's... You're a scientist. A good one. Yeah, the last project I worked on, I created a monster octopus that almost destroyed the city, so... Yeah. I mean, you do make a hell of a chicken curry. <laughs> I do. Still working on my dumplings, though. Going camping? Oh, uh, my uh, new place isn't going to be ready for about a week, so I'm going to be crashing with Miles for the next few nights. Oh. You know, you can always stay at my place. Only if you want to. No, I, I mean, I mean, I mean, yes. I mean, no, no. I don't. I not want to. But meaning, I, I, I do want to. But only if you do. I never stopped wanting to. Me neither. I'm not an expert or anything, but I think it's in the way that you ask her. Uh, I'm getting too nervous. <laughs> hey, all right, so where do you want this? Uh, right over here is fine. All right. Hey, so Pete? Yeah? I, uh, kind of got to talk to you about something I can't tell my mom about. What's up? Well, um, weird things have been going on. Like, physically. Oh. Oh. Uh. Well, you know, you're at that age where, where your, your body starts to change. And so you may be noticing some areas, no. for example. Not that. Uh. I think it's, I think it's better that I just, um. I show you. I show no, you. No, 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 no. <laughs> Pretty weird, right? Not that weird. So close. But I'll keep trying. I will find a cure. I will. I love you, son. 